Hi, welcome back. Here's a video about the freeze function. So the freeze function is basically it will freeze the track and uh, take a load off the CPU. So if you've got a lot of audio and a lot of especially uh, MIDI tracks with a lot of instruments, this is really useful. But it doesn't matter, it works the same way for both. So if um, you've got like a track with say some plugins like this and you want to freeze it, just go in to configure head track header and select freeze and then the icon freeze will appear here then make sure that you've got the end project marker near the end like here so if you've got it miles down the track it will go all the way there and freeze it all the way come back to the beginning of the track and when you put the freeze on and then start the track it will calculate it like a bouncing place and now that is frozen you can see all the uh, plugins are turned off but that track will play with the plugins and everything and even if there's like a, um, uh, a MIDI instrument that will be frozen as well and blanked out and it will be like a bounce in place the same thing as bounce in place it doesn't show up and then you can unfreeze it by doing that and then you can edit it and then freeze it back again yeah freeze it back again and then duck. so if you've got a big session with loads of instruments this is really useful so that's your freeze function i hope you enjoyed the video if you did like subscribe and i will see you soon ciao